All right, so what I'm gonna try to do today is set a stone in this. I've never done this before, so it's probably gonna, mm, gonna not go perfect, but that's okay. Uh, what I wanna do is probably set it where his eye is. I think that'll be cool. And this is the stone I'm gonna be working with. This is a three millimeter cubit zirconia. I'm just going to set it over here so I don't lose it. And... Before I ratchet this in there, I'm going to try and mark where I want to drill into. Yeah. In a good little spot. That should work. Maybe this isn't the best way to hold a coin while I'm doing this, but this is what I've got. So we're going to give it a shot. Hopefully I don't move out too much. All right, so now we've got to get our bits. There's a couple different types of bits you need to do what I'm trying to do. It's gonna be a flush setting. And this is my first try doing this, guys. So don't don't be too mean. But we're gonna give it a we're gonna give it a shot. So these are our ball burr bits. I'm gonna use these second. Got a little bit of Pepe lube here. I'm just gonna lube up those bits. That'll be good. I've got some open, so we'll use that one. And uh, if you guys have any questions while I'm working on this, feel free to ask. I'm just kind of experimenting today. And here is our drill bit bits. And we just need one more bit set. There it is. This one. So what I'm going to try and do is set a stone where his eye is, right there. <laughs> I'm probably going to knock into my camera while I do this, so, you know, again, y'all be nice. I'm trying something new. We're going to start with the drill bit, little bitty one I've got here. This one, I think it's a 123rd, and we're just gonna drill out that eye. I gotta switch out what I've got in my flex shaft here. We'll get going. I'm kind of excited, honestly. I really like trying new stuff, so this is gonna be cool. And I'm just putting this drill bit in my flex shaft real quick. Sorry, I'm not doing a bunch of cool cameraman stuff this time. I'm a little more focused on the tools than the cinematography at this point. So I got this little bitty bit on here. 
Make sure it's nice and tight. And turn the flex shaft on. Do, do, do. Maybe we'll zoom out just a little bit. I have to do is drill straight down into that eye hole like that and pull this over here a little bit come on now it's just gonna fall okay and it's just tearing this bit up or it's like pushing it further in maybe it's a kind of a short bit so I might just be pushing into my flex shaft so I'm just give it another little try here all the way up in there huh. and we did not get all the way through but we did get a little spot isn't bad we'll try and try a bigger bit maybe that one's just too tiny Yeah, it looks like the coin just ate it up, man. Too small. It looks like this one's gonna go all the way in here too. Need longer tiny bits. Cause this thing just drops. Get maybe like less than a millimeter of it sticking out. We'll give it a shot. up here, go straight down, did we get through, a little bit, alright, cool, cool, I gotta chill out a little bit. If I go too heavy with these other ones, that stone's not gonna fit in there. But we've got a hole, which is cool. Do a little previews. That's kind of what we're going for. It's gonna look something like that. Here's our hole so far.
These are called ball burrs. They're nice and round. And we're just gonna slowly work this up in size here. It's interesting, they're, they're numbered. So I guess I'll have to actually measure to see what size it is, because I don't know what those numbers mean. The biggest one in the set is 2.2 millimeters. I'll start with this one. Give it a go. This one's gonna be the number 18. And I'm just kind of experimenting here, guys. Don't take anything I say to the bank. First time trying this out. little ball burr on there. I'll put a little bit of a little bit of lube on it. Try it. Straight down. Nice. I want to take this in about kind of like that. And I'll just step that up. So far, so good. So far, so good. So this is the, the biggest ball burr I have. We're gonna step this up a little bit bigger and then we'll go to a different shape. Nice. Put these up. This is called like a seat burr, something like that. So these are shaped like the stone. See how they're kind of pointy? And that's going to be the last thing we need to set this. Or so I've been led to understand. This is the first time I'm doing this. So wish me luck.
I'm just trying to find the one that's closest to three millimeter. That's gonna be this one. And I'm actually gonna start with one just under that size and drill in it just a little bit and then work it up. Cool, 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 cool. This is looking good. I'm I'm practicing my first stone setting. So I've never done this before. I've spent a lot of time researching this, watching a bunch of different videos and the like, but today I decided to actually give it a shot. We'll see if I can get a three millimeter stone to set in this coin. It would be cool. If I got it on the first try, wouldn't it? So for this, what I'm looking for is I just want to get it like about halfway down after it starts like making that point. So where it actually goes straight I want to give it, get about halfway in there. So we're going to try and go real slow. Looks pretty cool, looks pretty cool. All right, so here is our stone. And I'm thinking this is still probably too small for it, but we're gonna go ahead and pop it in there and give it a little test. That's really very close. How cool is that? Look at that. All right, I'm gonna pop this out of here. If it, it's it's like I don't want to get out. Let's see if we can go from underneath. So this is like like less than a millimeter more drilling I need to do. Just just very slight. So we don't want it to be too big have the stone be loose so that sounds like a horse Good afternoon. Thanks you guys for watching. I'm sorry I'm not checking a bunch of the comments. I'm, like I said, I'm trying something new here, so I'm really trying to focus on it. God, that looks really good. Let me pop it in. It's not quite. Get out. 
Okay, I'll go a little deeper. Sensitive pedal. That thing just goes off. Oh my gosh, guys. I think that's it. I think that's it. So now, <laughs> I'm so excited. That's awesome. Oh my gosh, look, look. Look, look, look. Yay! Just had it. okay. So this is a burn. Uh, I think I need a smaller one than this, maybe a little sharper. But basically, what I'm supposed to do now is move the metal on the outside of this around it to kind of lock it in. We're just gonna we'll just rub it. I mean, it's a little, it's pretty cool. Real thing. Not bad for a first try, huh? I'm sweating. I'm not going to lie to you. So I'm supposed to test it. See if I can poke it out. Yeah. So I'm actually going to drill a little bit more on it. Get it a little deeper. Because it's not quite set. I'm not going to congratulate myself if it's just going to fall out, you know? Thank you. So the goose wants to go in upside down. Oh, okay.
I'm trying my first stone, stone setting. I've, I've never done this before. So we set a three millimeter stone here on Kennedy's face. And it wants to stay in. I can't pop it out. Woo! Watch. Boom. It's stuck in there, man. That is too cool. Too freaking cool, guys. Thanks for watching. Uh, thanks for the support. Uh, the cheers along the way. I'm really glad this, this went so well. Now I just got to figure out how to do this on a ring. And I'll be gold. That was fun. That was a lot of fun. And it's like super smooth. Like you can you can slide right over it and you wouldn't even notice. That's that's so cool. Try and get a better definition. Visual for you guys. Did scratch it up a little bit. I ain't gonna lie there, but how cool! Yeah, I definitely think I need a, a different burnisher. Look at that! It's a half dollar. Got a little breathing hole on the back here. Yeah, I just did this. It's my first one I've ever done. My first set stone. Pretty cool. I guess maybe we should try a ring. So this is a Kennedy half dollar. And this is a finished Kennedy half dollar. So they're going to be the same thickness. So that stone should work on this. Just trying to figure out where I should put it. Put it right. Put it right in the middle here. Maybe. Put it on the O. Hmm. We put it in a little blank spot there. Or put it on the circle on dollar. That might be cool. I don't know, I'll probably try and practice on this one a couple times. So I'm gonna start with this blank spot here between dollar and America, right where that little O is, or maybe right like in the middle of these stars in that dot. I think that's where I'll put it. spot there we go
we're gonna punch it with this thing first. <laughs> yeah, I didn't think that would work. I'll set it over here and punch it. Can y'all see that mark? Probably not. It's like right there. So that's what we're going for. Go ahead and get a little drill bit on here. And drill through it. I don't know why I was so scared of trying this. I've been really anxious about it. But now that I'm up in here doing it, it's it's pretty fun. Usually I'm making coin rings like this. I make coins into rings. But today I'm trying out a new skill. Now this is going to be tricky because this is a curved surface. I'm going to be drilling into it, so i got to be careful not to hurt myself. Safety first. Find where our punch is. Move our camera out of the way. And turn the flex shaft on. That's a good idea. Nice. <sighs> Not the smoothest hole ever cut, but it's in there. Now for anybody who hadn't seen before, there's there's three kinds of, of things that we use. We used uh, this kind of drill. This is a really small hole that we're gonna drill into it all the way through. Then there's these, these are called ball burrs. They're shaped like balls. And that's what we're gonna use next. And then this is, I believe they're called setting burrs. So these are shaped like the stone that we're putting in there. And these aren't great at drilling, but they set the shape of the seat for it. So we'll use those last. What are we making? Well, I just set my first stone ever. I'm really excited about it. We put it in this half dollar here. And I immediately was like, well, let's try it on a ring. So that's what we're doing right now. We're uh, trying to set a stone in a ring. This will be the first time I've ever done it. Thanks for joining me. Start with a small ball burn. This little bitty one here, and just work our way up. If we started with a bigger burr, we would wear out that burr pretty quickly. So we make a small hole, make it a little smaller, make it a little smaller, or a little bigger, a little bigger, and then shape it and see if the stone fits. Try not to go over. Try and get it just right. We did really good on that half dollar. So we'll see how it goes. We've got our ball burr on here. We got a little bit, uh, this is just like Pepe lube to uh, also reduce that wear and tear on this burr. And we want to go straight up and down.
Nice. And we want to go a little deeper. That's good. That looks good. Sorry if this isn't super clear, but we're just we're just expanding that hole out there. That looks better. And we'll go to the next size up. This is pretty fun. A lot of switching parts, but like I get why you gotta do it. Any opinion on what color I should put in here? I've got those clear ones we just did. I've got blue, purple, and red. Let me know what you think. What should we, what should we do? No opinions? Nobody wants to pick the color? Alright, I'll do I'll do red, I think. I think red will look cool. Again, I'm just all in the way of the camera here. But I'll try and try and space it out. Purple? I can do purple. Sounds cool. <laughs> So I'm trying to take these out of the bag, right? Like I'm trying to fish one out. I've got my finger in the bag here. Guess what? They're in a second bag. <laughs> That's pretty funny. All right, we just want one. Try and see how the fit is in here. Well, this is a lot easier to put in on the coin. Oh wow, I just popped right in there. That is pretty. Look. Oh my gosh, so pretty. But is it in far enough? I don't think it is. How do I secure the gemstone? That's gonna be uh, here in just a second. So basically what I need to do is I need to drill down far enough where like the, 
the widest part of the gemstone is just underneath the surface of this metal. And then I get this tool. No, not that one. This one. It's called a burnishing tool. And what this does is it like pushes that layer of metal over just the tiniest bit of the top of the stone. And that's, that's how we lock it in. It's really hard to visualize, but that's what's happening. Like it's hard to see it because it's such a small difference. Uh, no, these are just uh, cubit zirconia. Um, I, this is honestly the second stone I've ever set. Uh, the first one I did about, I don't know, 12 minutes ago. So I'm just, I'm just practicing with like fake diamonds or whatever until I get a little better. And I'm sorry, I'm so zoomed in here. This is not the JFK, so are you drawing it before? No. That one, I can't believe it, I already lost it. It's around here somewhere. There it is. So this is the first one I did. I did this first. And that's like, that's in there, in there. Like at some angles, this is really, very pretty. It's cool. But the purple looks good too. I'm sorry I'm so zoomed in, but I have to have space for my hands. So that's, that's what we got. Kind of. Yeah, I'm on live. What's up? Come with it, so make five friends in the wasteland. So it's just on the edge of being. I haven't enough space, so we're gonna we're gonna try and burnish it in. Not quite deep enough in there. But it also doesn't want to come back out. Yeah, super tiny drill bit. Oh, I was going to poke it through the bottom hole, but it fell out. Okay. So we're gonna drill in just a little bit more. That looks about right. Uh, 
Oh, yeah. Yes, sir. Yes. Oh, my gosh. This is so pretty. Still got a little wiggle to it. Not too shabby. I'm gonna make a size 14 uh, in anything over a quarter, so half dollars, dollars, American Eagles. Yeah, I can do size 14. What's this with focus? Oh, yeah, there we go. Look at those. Try and get that. Hit some light there, man. That is, that is cool. My phone hates me. There we go. Lucky, lucky. I can definitely do better on burnishing this in here. You can see I've definitely scratched it up a little bit. But the stone is, it's seated, right? It's in there. A little, a little uneven from this angle, but pretty. This is the first one I did. Pretty cool. Awesome. I appreciate you supporting my small business, man. And some other people's orders sitting over here. Gotta ship those out. I'll try and get a real good look at this before I, I head out. Look at that. That purple is very nice. Thank you for recommending purple. Too cool. Well, thanks for joining me here, guys. I'm going to head out. This was a lot of fun. Uh, check out the store. There's lots of cool stuff on there. I uh, should have <laughs> stones pretty soon. Bye.